Hello, this is John Black, Super Demist. Here with a nice, easy video. Now, this is not an instructional video. I'm not condoning anyone to do this. This is just something I did a couple times back in the day, like 20, 30 years ago or whatever. Um, but it's a way to uh, get rid of uh, fumes or whatever, you know what I mean? But keep in mind, there are laws about putting certain chemicals down the drain so you, if you do do this you gotta watch that too um, here's a sink okay it's a, not a good drawing here's your plumbing going down to your sewage right we all know that you got a little u-trap there right and the reason why there's a u-trap is because then the water can't it can only go to this line see right here you fill the water up here it'll push it down so that it goes back to this level um, that way you always have water in here. The sewage fumes don't come back up into the house, right? They get blocked by this water, by this U-trap. So what you do is you, you can take this off right here, right? Keep in mind the water level's up to here, so you're going to have to put a bucket under here. Catch the water, right? Then you can swivel this. Swivel it out so that it's not right directly under here, right? Now here's an enlarged picture of it. This black thing here is a hose. It's a tiny, you know, small hose. The diameter of, let's say, you had a distillation unit, and at the end here, you know, there's a little vacuum barb thing that you can attach a hose to. You can attach the hose to that, right? Bring the hose up, shove it down in here so that it goes all the way up like that, right? Then blow through it, okay? Before you connect it up here, blow through it. To get the water out, because you're going to get. What is that? Yeah, I'd blow through it. I'd try to blow through it to get the water out of there um, and push it down in there. Um, now, when your fumes come out, right, they'll come out, travel through the hose, and they'll go down into this area here. Now, they can't come back into the room because you're, you know, you have this U trap. And you should also get some, what I used to do is get some tape, uh, regular duct tape, so that get it nice and sealed up around here, you know what I mean? Then get some uh, clear plastic scotch tape and tape it around, you know what I mean? And uh, now you have a way for your fumes to go out. Let's say you're distilling ethanol, okay, just as an example. Um, because I know there's a lot of bars, so I know they pour that down the drain. Um, you can do that, and that way you don't have to worry about the fumes or whatever. Of course, ethanol is a bad example because all you have to do is lead this hose to another room. And you really don't have to worry about it. I mean, you can have an open cup. I mean, if I'm drinking vodka, I don't, you know, put a lid on my cup, you know, so no one blows up. You know what I mean? As long as it's cool and, you know. But that's just to give you an example. Say it was poisonous, but depending on the poison, it got you know what I mean. You got to watch because environmental things. That's why I, I say this is not an instructional video. It's just showing you something I did back in the day. Uh, it does work. Um, you know, if you're like in an apartment building or something, uh, you know it. it I should try this with the styrene. I wonder if it's, but I don't know if you can put styrene down the drain. I don't think you can. Anyways, uh, I just wanted to put it up and trying to show everyone I'm not dead. I'm still doing videos. And this is a nice, easy one. I just have a, and I also wanted to bring up on BitChute. <clears throat> They're kind of confusing uh, on the, like when people post something and I need to reply. You know, it's great when there's only, because it'll take me to the page. Uh, but once a conversation, you get two or three conversations in there and a whole bunch of back and forth, it's hard to figure out where, because they don't, they only show you the page. They don't show you exactly the spot where these things are coming up. Like on YouTube, it'll take you to the page and then it'll, the page will skip up and a box will open and show you exactly where to, to reply at. You know what I mean? On BitChute, I got to look through sometimes 50 post or whatever I'm so confused it's like uh, so my point to the story is if you're posting questions or something on there and I don't reply you know uh, do it a second time 
um, because I will reply to everyone that you know if I know if I don't know though I can't reply uh, so just do it a second time um, it's a lot easier when there's no when there's no post already you know what I mean if, you, if there's no post I have no problem because I go to that page you're the only post there obviously it's, it's, it's no problem um, but anyways everyone have a great day I will be back soon and uh, always remember science is great <laughs>